We are back, and it takes three of us to handle this little guy. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> we got Brad Not the Pity right here, and um, he is super sweet, really good-looking uh, guy. I, I like dogs. This is my speed of dog. <laughs> And uh, if, if I didn't already have some at home, I might be talking to you about this one. So, <laughs> well, uh, he, tell us about him, Steve. Well, he came to us uh, from, hey. from the shelter, Does and it was really funny because he, was, he bit just about everybody at the shelter. So they had come to the conclusion that if you had blonde hair, you weren't going to get bit by this dog, which is obviously BS. But um, he's a very sweet boy. However, Brad. if you move too quickly and you don't work with him on resource guarding his food, you're going to get bit. Here at the facility, we've solved the, uh, the issue with the food, but doesn't mean it's not going to come back if you adopt him. So we're going to show you, if you adopt him, we're going to show you how to be successful. Again, he's very sweet. For the last, I would say, month and a half, he has not tried to bite anybody, and we've tested him. But again, he's going to feel cozy in a nice home, and he, he's going to like push the boundaries. Don't let that cute little face fool you. <laughs> he's a beast when he wants to be, but he's beautiful. He's so cu so cute and very, very, very affectionate. He loves to run. He loves to run and play and jump. And I just take a moment. So um, th this is this is the perfect example when, when we talk about dogs and, and we talk about kids over 12, kids over 5, we're talking about size and strength of the animal, not knowing there's there that. But dogs like this, this is the perfect type of dog for a, a kid that's just gonna run, love, wanna pick them up, play with them like a toy. And they're gonna get bit in that scenario, especially if they're eating. Now, now we're not saying he's gonna bite everyone who you wanna play with. But remember, what type of dogs bite? All dogs bite. All dogs bite. <laughs> if they got teeth, they bite, they right? Bite. Even they if they gums, don't they have bite. teeth, they, 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 they know you. So death. it is all about <laughs> knowing the dog. And like yeah. Steve said, this is a cute, adorable little dog that, that can take a finger, right? <laughs> well, well, we always like to say, you know, dogs don't know they're cute. And yeah. he's, a, he's a beast when he wants to be. But with the right person, he won't bite. But you have to know what you're doing. Um, it, it, honestly, this could be the dog of a lifetime with the right people. But you just kind of have to listen to us. If you've never had a dog before and you listen to us, you're going to be fine. But if you think you know what you're doing, you don't listen to us, you're going to get bit. And I'm not going to feel sorry for you. But he's, uh, he's a very cute boy. And I, we love him. He's one of our favorites. So this is our public service announcement. All yeah. dogs bite, uh, no matter how cute and cuddly they look. And what I'm doing right now, I've been sitting here, I want to pick this guy up and play with him so much, but I'm just going to sit here and let him come to me when he's ready. If he's not coming to me, well, I'll get time he's later. He's a good judge of character. Right? Anyway. <laughs> Thanks. And if you want to need more about Brad Not the Pity, or you want to learn about Steve, you can uh, <laughs> fill out a form on thelittlereddog.org. And uh, we'll, we'll call you and introduce you to Steve and Brad. We Thanks, love guys. To see him in a home. Yeah, We'd love to see him in a he's home. He's an amazing yeah. dog. We'll be back. Bradley, not the pig. Yeah.